we have been indoctrinated in our thinking and in our desires. When we were young and we were born, most of us can understand that we were born free. We didn't come out of our mother's womb with desires to say, I want to make a million dollars or desires to be a Hollywood star or desires to have a sports car, for example. All these desires are desires that we acquired as we processed or went through the world around us. Now, these desires were expressed to us in what? Well, for example, just sit down and watch any television commercial that is on the TV or these television commercials and you will see that they are pushing that your worth, your value is in what you can buy material wise. That if you have enough money and can buy enough material things, then this will bring you happiness and you will be happy if you succeed in doing this. Other desires such as getting married, having a family, um, having a good position in work, all these things are been programmed before us, has been shown to us that this is what is the contents of life. This is what we should be living for. Now, through those desires, through going after these desires, we are allowed to, or we have been taught, that it is okay to walk upon one another. That in going after these desires, it will create different classes of people. Some will be poor, some will be middle class, some will be rich, and you will be taught that you definitely don't want to be poor. So therefore, struggle, fight, and if you succeed in this present capitalistic system by making a good deal amount of money, then you will have success. You will be happy and everything will be okay, which is a lie. In one way, if you succeed, if you make your way in this capitalistic system that has nothing to do with equality and you gain, for example, through hard work, which is what it will take in this system, millions of dollars. Well, these millions of dollars will not shelter you from everything. It will provide you security. It will provide you uh, a shelter against material things, your food, uh, your bills, whatever other material need that you would have in life, but your money will not shelter you from debt. Your money will not shelter you from sickness. Your money will not shelter you from accidents. So this goal that's being presented to us as the ultimate of achievement to sit in the ruling rich classes of persons is not what life is about. When we sit back, if we could sit back and think and really analyze we need to understand that first and foremost, before anything else, life is about equality. Me and you are equal and what I am treated and what I acquire, you should be treated the same and you should acquire the same. Why? Because that is a universal principle. That is a governing principle that is powerful. And using that to build on as a foundation can build societies that are incredible, can build human beings that respect and love one another, not that want to hurt one another or are jealous against one another or want to use one another in order to obtain that rich class, that desired class.